Crystal Baby. Crystal Baby. Hey, it's me. Hey, Muscle Beast 88 Cyber Warrior. Welcome back, son. Who gonna go to the cool gonna Who gonna call clown? He's the clouch! Stein! Nell! Oh, yes, welcome, my friends. Oh, lingerie! Oh, we freeze block me. Why, Luke? Why? It's already freezing. No, don't tell me that. Please don't tell me that. I can't take another fucking frozen fucking nonsense here. I will not have it! I will not settle! J Masters last is that J Masters last 40 ounce? <laughs> what up, bro? LFC MMA. You gotta check out their uh, podcasts on uh, SoundCloud. There's a whole bunch of different places, but I've been uh, using the um, SoundCloud embedded link. I be post. I, I, I be posting them on M Muscle Yes. Garrett Doc, what's up, Garrett Doc? Yeah, we're hearing a little, a little of the theme music for LegalSteroids.com presents Gearing Up. They're having this big summer special. You save twenty percent on stacks, but Muscle Video Authority gives you thirty percent off on everything. So use whichever one you want. Go with the third. Silver Surfer, oh yes, I like the Silver Surfer, he was cool Marvel Comics, and it was a good movie, the second um, uh, Fantastic Four, Gab Gotten, popping in to say what's up in between studying, you better pass that fucking medical exam, health subs in all the way Australia! What do you think about reparations? I knew you were going to ask me that. I was just looking at some stuff on Fox and on Twitter. Amazing, Fruity. What's up, Moron? I am ready to get in line. My checkbook is in hand. I have multiple pens. I'm ready to write my reparations for slavery checks. The first one they get will be... <laughs> Here, I'll give you this. A used bottle of Anno Drawl. That's my reparations to you. Welcome to LegalSteroids.com presents Gear Em Up. I am your host, Joe Pietaro. I publish this magazine with the lovely Thea Renee Duller on the cover. Yes, reparations. They're having hearings right now. Today's Juneteenth. Juneteenth. Gav, you have the nicest ladies on your fucking page, bro. Oh, I'm fighter. What's up, bro? Oh, I'm fucking fighter. Turkish Todd, it's like Turkish Taffy. You know, you know Turkish Tacky? Go live with Nick. I, 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 I won't say it. <laughs> the silver butthole surfer, Grandma. <laughs> oh, wasn't a silver surfer like a bad guy in the movie? I don't remember him being that bad of a guy when I was a kid reading the comics. What about you, Nikki? <laughs> I was making that sound this morning as I fucking as I fucking made love to a tissue. <laughs> hey, here it is right now. I'm just kidding. This ain't. Oh well, yeah, it is. <laughs> the people who are serious about how much money is it? <laughs> Jerry Ward. He's one percent black. <laughs> Um, I don't know exactly, Area IBF, what's up, motherfucker? I don't know exactly what they're looking for, they haven't been like, but they're saying it's going to be more given towards programs in their neighborhoods and stuff. Stop! Enough, Burgess Owens, a former NFL player and a hell of a fucking safety for the Jets in the 70s, and he actually won a ring with the, um... Uh, with the the eighty Oakland Raiders when they beat the Eagles in the Super Bowl at the Detroit Silverdome, um, uh, he he was on Capitol Hill today. He's a Democrat, but he he believes in conservatism and many things. I'm not that loud, I, especially when the kids are home. I can't be. Giuseppe, what's up? 
What happened, Nikki D? Yeah, where the fuck is that kid? He came on once after that mono, and then that fucker didn't show up to the goddamn fucking uh, Jersey thing. He said, fucking be responsible for yourself. Pick yourselves up by your bootstraps. Stop looking for handouts. And the Democrats should pay the fucking black people's shit because they've been fucking them for decades. Joe, is that Sharwana King in Queens any good? Is that a rub and tug? Bro, <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Poor Nick D got taken out by the mono ultraviolet. Pray for Nick D. Yeah, where has that young man been? Uh, I had them all fucking set up, picked out <laughs> to be my son-in-law. I would go to all your events. I, I hope the, uh, to meet you in person one day. And I'd like to buy you a beer, and then we can clink, it's so gay, clink to good times, everybody. We used to go to better blowjobs when we were fucking youngsters. Did you see how Tony, huge Tony has gotten, like mini rich piano? Now you're talking about Tony huge, how huge Tony huge has gotten? Is that what you're talking about? Or Tony who? Tony, Tony bag of donuts? <laughs> Is mono the devastating? Uh, I don't know. I've never had it either. Uh, I remember when it was going around, they said, don't share your drinks. And they called it the kissing disease. Because I guess it was in your oral saliva type of thing. So if, I, if I'm if i like telling some girl, spit in my mouth while I'm fucking you, I guess I could catch mono from her. Raw can be. Uh, I, I haven't seen Tony lately. Yes, he's the sign one the quitty. He doesn't know if he can handle the toxicity of 2020 election. Wait, hold on a second. Don Lemon. Oh, fuck that fucking savage. Fucking dick-smoking savage. He's 53. He actually looks pretty good for his age. I, I'll give him credit where credit's due. Tony Huge. Tony Huge is huge. Tony Huge has a great life. He does look like that. I mean, from everything that I've seen... Um, he seems to be uh, always laughing, always smiling. He's always got hot broads around him. Um, so, you know, I have to say Tony Huge, definitely um, he's living the good life. And uh, he was a fucking lawyer, a real estate lawyer. And he was, like, bored with it. So he fucking uh, decided to, to travel the world, shoot steroids, and hang out with hot broads. T uh, relish the thought would have to coffee 10 years. Oh, good for you, bro. I'm a big coffee guy also. I'm a huge coffee guy. Ten years, nine months, 19 days without a drink, but who's counting? You knew I was going to say that, that cliche. Who's counting? Good for you, bro. I don't drink a lot. I drink, I drink more in one weekend when I'm at an expo than I do probably in two months at home. Uh, what do you think of his chick's hygge? Hygge loves baby mama. Finished in the shower. You have my undivided attention. Did you utilize the stream for an orgasm? That's what I want to know. The shower stream. I, I always got so turned on when ex-girlfriends used to do that. They would tell me they jerk off in the shower. So when I would fuck them in the shower, I'd see, show me. Let me see how that works, baby. <laughs> <laughs> the faucet thing. <laughs> uh, not the black ones, of course. You don't know what that comment will do to Joe. Yes, I was pitching her soaping up her beautiful boobs uh, and her fucking beautiful fucking breasts and clitoris and her butthole, even though she does not do butt things. Her and Rich don't do butt things. 831.08. Good for you, bro. I need to name my shower head. Oh, God. So I, 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 see, there you go. That's all she needed to say. And the fucking, all of a sudden, the erection is a coming because uh, uh, that is that is definitely, uh, she, she, she utilizes it. Call it fucking, um, call it Joey. <laughs> Make believe it's my tongue. <laughs> How real Tony is number a while back. He said he baby mama because he was caught chlamydia when he was out of state. He caught chlamydia. Yes, I remember you were saying that. We tried butt sex once. I guess it wasn't that good. How far did he get it in, though? Because he's fucking well endowed, I would think. He's a big guy. His hands. Rich shakes my hands. It's like fucking I, the old catches mitt saying. Um, so I'm a, I'm a picturing that he's got a large member. <laughs> Joe the Shell. <laughs> hey, if I, if that's the closest I can get and jerking off the fucking videos that she doesn't get pulled down off a of porn up, <laughs> it's good enough for me. 
<laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Shredded Kev, what's up, bro? How the fuck are you? He got it in halfway or so. He did get off. Oh, so he was able, so you let him go in halfway and fucked her. See, I would, I would take that from my wife. I would go in even fucking head only. Let's see what this, uh, Alec, what did you write here? I was looking at new hot tubs and they offer an attachment where the jet head is on a three foot hose. That could be fun. Ooh, chlamydia. Nine and a half inches. Mean kebabots. Holy shit. I would fuck them. <laughs> What are symptoms of syphilis? Asking for a friend. I'm going to have to refer to my fucking medical professional. <laughs> Brad, what's up? <laughs> FG on a hell B. What the fuck's going on, motherfucker? <laughs> See, I'm confused because your, your Instagram account says Brad, but your subscription has a different first name. So am I fucking up your... Is it Brad? <laughs> If it isn't, just tell me. I feel stupid. Rod, they're bad. Even causes mental disturbance, probably if not treated. Syphilis. Yes, did it, isn't that what happened to, uh, to, to my long lost, uh, relative Al Capone when he was in fucking. Damn, hubby got a big cock crystal. Alec, can me and you measure up to him at all? <laughs> Combined? <laughs> Nine and a half. Jesus, are you sure he ain't just a fucking albino negro? <laughs> Get the penicillin shot. His real name is fucking... <laughs> Toby. <laughs> hey, Bug, what's up? Brad, middle name, that's what I go by. Oh, okay, so if I call, so if I call you Brad, that's good. Palace Kevin, what's up, pal? John Woodhell, yo, what's up, guys? Go to, um, my, on my Kamasikama Instagram, buy a t-shirt for Georgie's, little Georgie Coates, um, lifting for autism event. I'm gonna put a post up on, um, uh, on, uh, the, the website too, but it's on, it, I have a graphic on the, uh, thing. I accuse him of having something, something in the wood pile all the time. Ooh. I know what that means. Are you going to have Jay Masters on? I don't know. Is Jay here? Jay's new show, Bedroom Bully Bonanza. I love the way he says it. I got a new episode. I'm finishing a um, uh, um, uh, uh, video edit of with Chris Gronkowski. Um, and then I'm going to be putting up the new MSTV, which has episode two of... Uh, Bedroom Bully Bonanza starring the one and only Big J Masters. Yes, Lifting for Autism. It's on June 29th uh, in Arkansas. And uh, there's, they're selling t-shirts. They're like 15 bucks. I'm going to buy one. I'm going to send it to Ray's uh, Kamasi Kama, his uh, uh, PayPal. Joe, I sent you a message on Facebook when you get a chance. Is it a dick pic, John? Because if not, then you need to send me two messages. <laughs> Do you have nine and a half inches like uh, Rich Anthony, Miss M Mr. Crystal does? <laughs> I think Joe was right about Al Capone. Yeah, he died of syphilis. He did. Now, he was in jail for a while. How did he get it? That's a good question. Bentonville, Arkansas. I need your two inches to match up with Crystal's stud. So you're saying you are 7.5. Alec D's got a seven and a half inch penis, brothers. I don't know. I'm I, I'm not real Mr. Crystal. <laughs> like Billy Crystal. <laughs> Do the benefits for lifting the autism go No, stop. George Coat, that's Ray Crunchy Crush's uh Coat's uh, uh, uh son and Autumn, obviously his mom. Uh the big event that Georgie wanted to put on to help uh kids like himself with autism. So it's 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 full benefit. It's fucking and it, and the little kid He's like seven or eight, Georgie Coat. Um, it's this is all his idea. Ray obviously helped him with it. You know, he was like, "All right, George, uh, go make some phone calls, see who's available, which gym." You know, so <laughs> John Woodall's gym in Arkansas uh, is is the place that's hosting the big event, and uh, Ode Hogan is going to be there. Ode Hogan, famous uh, powerlifter, strongman guy. Why should wait? Hold on, is he measuring in centimeters? I am. Why should people who never were slaves get money for going through slavery? That's a good question. John, what is the... It, it, I, I believe it's, it, there is an Instagram page. Um, I think it's uh, Lifting for Autism, but I think it's uh, F-O-R, not the number four. Dimitar Savatinov. 
Oh, he's an Italian fella, right? <laughs> bad boys of rock and roll, bro. What's up, bad boys? How the fuck are you, buddy? How you been, my fucking pal? Palomine Ralphie! Hi, guys. Don't forget to watch. Oh, shit. That's right. The Kid Haynes. Fit Chicks to chat tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern Time. And she says, what am I going to be wearing tonight? And in the post, she's got like this. And then you can see like a little black, uh, like lacy thing with like fringes on it. So I'm probably going to fucking get very horny and turn on. Uh, I'm doing well, thank you. I'm sitting here hosting an Instagram live show with the family all around me. I'm feeling good. Joe, you're lucky. You can measure and send me some sick views and tweezers. Stretch it out in the millimeter side of a ruler. You seem unbothered by it, I guess. Dude, it's not going to fucking happen. Those fucking fools are fucking just wasting everybody's time. MS-13 muscle sport motherfucking mag. Stoof! What's up, Stoof? How the fuck are you? Preparations. Get the fuck out of here. Can you side boob? Side boob is great. You mean like this? <laughs> oh, there she is. The aforementioned Kim Fitness Haynes. I was talking about your post with you. <laughs> that little, that little, uh, who, me, innocent, what am I going to be wearing tonight? What I want you to do, I want you to come on camera. You obviously can't show it on Instagram, but get one of your vibrators, put it on your 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 your, your beautiful fucking vag, and just and and make it loud so we can hear it going. Johnny Rivers, Johnny Rivers is a big fan of uh, female bodybuilding. Johnny, you gotta watch Kim Fitness Haynes's um, uh, Fit Chicks chat tonight at eight. She always wears. Uh, dirty things, and she talks about having sex. Muscle chick sex. What does the liquid anna draw for you? I've seen in the post. Well, you see, this stuff, it's like I said, it, it's kind of like a muscle building thing. It's this, it, like I said, it's super steroids. It's stronger than steroids, but it is fucking nowhere near real steroids. Uh, supplements, I mean, stronger than supplements. It's not, for say, it's not stronger than steroids. Kim Fidesz Haynes, right there, Johnny Rivers. Kim, Johnny is a huge fan of muscle chicks, so I have a feeling that he's going to splooge all over his iPhone tonight. Did you see Jason with Plumbo? Not yet. Fuck side boob, Joe. Show you... <laughs> <laughs> the hip, the thass. <laughs> I'm too old for that. Is he a fan of Kof Debbie? Who isn't? Who isn't? Uh, I got to watch that Dave and Jason thing. I touched base with Jason the other day. I said, did you get my email about your column? And he wrote back, yes. <laughs> Whatever happened to Debbie, Debbie Downer? <laughs> she went down on me. <laughs> I don't know. It's like all of these uh, D-ball Debbie. I like that fucking first one that poses nude. Um, the one from the original World Gym. What the fuck? The one behind the counter? She was sexy. Did allergy... Dave allegedly let Jason hold his snake. Oh, fuck. Damn. I, I know Dave a long time. I never held his snake. <laughs> Did he stroke it? <laughs> if King could have had... Could... If Kim could have incredible action and could squirt across state lines, would you open your window and wait with your mouth open? Yes! <laughs> Unidentified flying object. Coming out of retirement. Oh, very cool. See, that's what happens. That's what happens. Uh, is a motivating guy. What, to masturbate? <laughs> so, Kim, do you think it's possible that you could get, like... Um, uh, you, I believe you said you have a Hitachi magic wand, which is like the Louisville slugger of fucking vibrators. It's huge. It's a plug-in. So no dead batteries. Um, and put it on that amazing fucking twat. And just... Oh, 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 oh God. Oh, fuck. And then hold the thing up and it's soaking wet. I was jerking off to a Denise Messino uh, webcam uh, video. And yes, Crystal, that is wrong of me, I know, because people pay for that. But I couldn't help myself. <laughs> I love Denise. <laughs> I spoke to her this morning, actually. I could. Please do it. Oh, my God. You, are you kidding me? That would fucking go viral. 
Girl comes on fucking Instagram. Yes, Pam. I didn't see the reference. I didn't see it because I'm thinking about this Denise video. I jerked off to this Denise Messino video and she was fingering herself and showing the webcam the fucking, you know, you could see it was, you know, that beautiful quim. Um, and I, 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 that made me think, I said, maybe Kim can't do that in, in, in person like that. Plus she should get paid for doing that and more than the shit I give her. <laughs> but I mean, just for fucking shits and giggles, even if you fake it, don't tell anybody crazy fit freak. She's crazy, she's fit, and she's a freak. And I want to eat a fucking shit sandwich and semolina bread of Thea Renee's poop. <laughs> oh, Thea Renee, welcome to the program, Thea. Thank you for gracing the cover of our current issue, Sexy Sergeant. Oh, I would fucking salute you full mast, baby. <laughs> I only occasionally keep up with Jason. You gotta swim in the warm fucking piss waters of Lake Cresvo over the claws. You with the crazy sense of humor would love it. Who is the lead for Lumbo's sidekick? He looks like a cab driver. Um, which guy? Because I know he has John Romano, Chris Aceto, and the guy who does his cameras and stuff now gets involved with it a little bit. Hubba hubba, arm fighter, 23 skidoo. Did you find it? <laughs> You're like me, I have those stupid old references, like speakeasy fucking references. Semolina breads, I say I've tried other breads before. Yes, I have, but not with her poop. <laughs> Yeah, but in this uh, in this webcam video, Denise Messino is fucking jerking off, and she first had a, a strap on on, and she was jerking the strap on, and then she took it off and turned it around and fucked herself with it, and uh, it was pretty cool. And the fucking idiot who named it put Japanese female body. They thought she was Japanese. She's fucking Puerto Rican from Brooklyn. <laughs> Her real last original uh, maiden name is Sanchez. Speaking of Romano, Dave sounds like Ray Romano. Hey, how you doing? I'm going to write my column. Crazy Fifth Freak is stunning. Yes, sir. That's why I have her on a cover. What do you think? I'm going to put an ugly person on the cover? <laughs> then I'd be on it. <laughs> I used to watch him every day, but all those from the H-Force every time. Oh, Jason? Yeah, well, you know, it, it, it doses. Doses. You can't have it, you know, like fucking two-hour fucking uh, podcast with him. Roaming, what's up, motherfucker? Bish Blaine and the Opico. Is that the Opico? It looks like a cute little baby in your picture there. Congratulations if that's a newborn. How do I order? What do you want to order? You want to order this so you can fucking jerk off to it? MuscleSportMag.com slash subscribe, bad boys. Gee, you want to order what? The Denise Messino video? <laughs> I believe I found it on... Was it... Which fucking was it? Was it Nude Vista? Or was it Hot Mo Hot Moves? I forget. What's up, everyone? Long time. Joe always working during shows. That's all right, Romig. Thank you for coming in, my friend. Hell yeah. Who is your least favorite biological family member? Oh, that's a tough one, bro. Order 66 of them bitches. Who, Dan from Thailand? <laughs> um, I don't know. You know, listen, my brothers and I have had our differences, but we've kind of have been, you know, dealing with all the shit going on. We've we've had problems during this, but it's also made us closer to uh, your transmission was having problems, Joe, of your broadcast. I see everybody's always fucking with with this thing here. It always, I don't know why it gets fucking like that, but thank you for letting me know. It, it's something with Instagram. I've got another video on Reddit. Someone posted. I need to get. Oh shit! I'm. Don't do. Let me. Let me get it before you do that. How do I find it on Reddit though? What would. What is. What is it under? Is it. Is it in that. Uh, that. That sub. Sub. Red. The fucking. Uh, slash bodybuilding. I think there's another female bodybuilding. I had one I made, I created a sub called Hardcore Bodybuilding, but it I just kind of stopped fucking bothering it. <laughs> Liquid Andro. Oh, this. I thought you meant the magazine. Uh, LegalSteroids.com, bad boys. And use this code, MuscleVideo30. Uh, you, you fucking save 30%. 30 fucking percent. 30%. 
McFit by Matthias by McFit. What's up, motherfucker? I know nothing about Reddit, but someone sent me the link. Can you send it to me? Come on, let me jerk off to you. Come on, you you, you use my, the faucet under my nail. <laughs> That's good, Joe. I'm glad you guys put things aside. Yeah, you got it. So I don't really have, like, I hate this family member. You know, probably myself. <laughs> For jerking off all the time. <laughs> I waste so much time jerking off. I can't complain I get no work done when I spend an hour masturbating every fucking day. <laughs> Send me the link. <laughs> Bad Boys, Muscle Video 30, I'm serious. King Jared, what's up, bro? Release the tape. <laughs> yes, the shower tape. I despise Reddit. I have to wait eight minutes to post a video. Yeah, that, right, that's right. And it's fucking annoying, man. I used to go on it a lot when I was doing stuff with the with the Kumias and shit, and we were, you know, it was like a lot of a lot of pain in the asses on there. You can't share it though. I hate that guy. No, I'm only going to use it for research. I'm going to look at it for research purposes only. I promise I will fucking fill many a Kleenex with uh, baby Joey's. <laughs> Keep this. Kefis, you I got the video for no I'm only kidding Chris <laughs> Go live with King Jared King Jared He doesn't realize he's royalty you guys are making him feel like you know I don't know I think you're fucking spooking him a little bit with all this king HGH for the anchor this <laughs> Oh fuck I got my old office back It's a video on my old set of boobs that were twice this size. Was that now? Was that the original video from X Videos? Because that one was great. Shame on me for not fucking ripping that one down before they did. Because oh my god, that was great. Because it was from far away. I could see your whole body and hear your voice and see your face. And oh god, it was just it was it was as close as fucking coming <laughs> with you in the fucking same place. You're gonna be responsible for driving to buy a new computer screen. <laughs> <laughs> AJ, yo, what's up? AJ, this one is different. Ooh, new material. <laughs> See, I tell her when I jerk off the crystal. I don't hide these things. I say, hey, guess what? I jerked off to you. <laughs> Oh, see, I wish a girl goes, hey, you know what I did before? I was watching this video of you, and I was fucking playing my fucking clit, and I came. <laughs> I'm more muscular. Mm. Mm. Do you take it in all three holes? No. <laughs> Do you show the wet fingers like Denise Messino did in that video? I fucking... Splooge to yesterday. Julie Vitali sounds like somebody from my old neighborhood. Hey, where's that Vitali check? Hey, oh. hey, Dale, Dale, what, you, is everything uh, for October? We got to figure that out because uh, uh, I'm not gonna go to fucking Ruby. I'd rather go to that thing if you're gonna have at least two of you guys doing it. Do you talk about pre cum at Thanksgiving, Joe? No, no, that would be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> if I was in Crystal's house, I might. Joe, is it the Bell Terrell coming to Chicago? I have no idea, but she usually, uh, she does uh, compete in those, right? Those headphones of Beats by Frankie Valley. <laughs> Isabel Terrell, I would fucking definitely eat a log of shit out of her ass. That's without a doubt. Requirement woman, you gotta be a freak. <laughs> and if you're not, I'm gonna fucking make you one. I need to know what show and if we are actually going. Yeah, I, 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 you know, I'm not gonna go to the fucking Ruby if if it's gonna be nobody there. I need to get with Jason Lenny finals. So we have plenty of time. It's a month after the other one was gonna be. So I bet you have a hoe at the turkey, right? Oh, you mean I fuck the turkey? Like after we pull the stuffing out, I actually put my my my, my member in. <laughs> yeah, stuffing's a little different this year, right? There are thoughts. Dale is Crystal going to the show. Dale's competing in the show. Dale is competing in the show, and then I'm hoping Jason will, and then Lenny. I don't know if we, uh, uh, if if he's healthy enough. Joe, what are my feelings on Frankie Lyman? Now, is that the doo-wop singer you're talking about? Frankie Lyman and the teenagers, or what is that? Help me out, ABF. 
I, I know the name. It's uh, <laughs> giblets. <laughs> I, I pulled the giblets out. Uh, did you see Crystal live? No, I didn't know. It was, I saw your post yesterday, Crystal, and I didn't get a chance to go back on Instagram. So I don't know if you did the show last night or tonight. So I missed it, I guess. Uh, if I'm going to the show. Why wouldn't you ask me? Joe had a three-way with the turkey and seven fishes. The guinea dish on Christmas Eve. Crystal said she might compete. Do they have bodybuilding now? Probably not, because it's NPC, and they don't recognize bodybuilding. <laughs> I love the word tuts. It's not a bad word, but it's not leave respect undertone. Tuts, like tits? Do you have any version of Frankie? Frankie Lyman and Tina. Yes, I love that. Uh, what's that famous song? Something love tonight, whatever. Ah. Uh. I don't think I'm going to the Olympia. I'm California. Some, oh, fuck. Come on, Alec. I wanted to see your fucking seven and a half inch cock. <laughs> Brick. I'm going to do the second show later this week. All right. I, 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 why do fools fall in love? Yes. Thank you, John. Thank you. Why do birds sing from above? Why do fools fall in love? He must have got a lot of pussy, that kid. You know? Teenager in love. Why must I be? No, that was a different guy. I believe so. The one you just said, or is it spelled tots? Tits. Tits. Like Tits McGee. <laughs> tits McGee. But Frankie Lyman and the Teenagers was a doo-wop group in the 50s. They were, uh, uh, I guess they're getting reparations if they're still alive, because they were black guys. Um, but they sang great, man. He had that high pitch. He was a kid. Tell me that it's human nature. What? To, 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 toots? Oh, toots. Hey, toots. No, you know, that's almost like, it's, it's, it's kind of like a derogatory, like, hey, hey, sweetheart, hey, honey, hey, toots. Like that. You know, it's kind of like that. Johnny Juice, right? Hey, Johnny, if you're over there on 20th Avenue and you go, hey, toots, come over here. You gotta go? Kim, please break out that fucking, uh, that, 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 that lawnmower vibrator. <laughs> that thing is fucking huge. <laughs> I've never had a Blumpkin. I asked my wife to give me a Blumpkin, and she says, get the fuck out of here. Give yourself one, she says. I said, if I could, I would. King Handsome Joe, are you getting a little on the gay side there, King Jared? <laughs> Kim, I'll see you at the, the, at the thing there. The, the, the thing, the, the, the thing. <laughs> it's not a swear word. No, not at all. Hey, toots! You know, like I said, it's kind of, it's like an old-fashioned, like, hey, look at that dame over there. Look at that, look at that broad. You know, like something Frank Sinatra would say, like, in a fucking movie. Hey, hey, toots, come over here. Uh, watch me tickle the ivories. Huga, well, it's a good porn website of category for the mature Asians. You're really into mature Asians, aren't you? I've never really, and most, they almost we always look young. Like, you walk into a rub and tug and they all look like they're 18 except for the one fucking mama son. And she's the best one. She knows how to fucking get to the prostate. The other ones, you got to, no, no, a little to the left. Right, stop. No, you just had it, motherfucker. <laughs> look at the gals on the avenue. Hey, look at the gay, look at the gals. Look at the gams on those gals, those dames. Oh, they're hot. Dames. Look at, look at the stumps on her. I just use Google and go to video results, put in your keywords. They are over, they age overnight like a pear. <laughs> Eric the shit cock. <laughs> yeah, it looks fucking great, right? And all of a sudden you're like, <laughs> it's all fucking bruised. Dion DeMucci also sang Lovers Who Wander. I don't know if I know that one. Lala! What's up, Lala? I say broad seven, eight times a day to fucking hillbillies down here. And wants to look at me like I'm Joe fucking Pesci. <laughs> Oh, rub and tug, tell me about it. Well, that's a massage parlor. But uh, uh, they they massage your dick so you shoot a load and uh, you tip them for that. <laughs> you want me to tell you where to find the hottest intelligent chicks? Uh, no. <laughs> no. Kim to the T to the Gil to the Roy. There she is. There she is, baby. Kim's going on her little fucking trip. Her trip with that the fitness trip. I know what they're doing over there. Ooh wee. Ask Jared what his top three favorite porn categories are. Jared, what are your top now nah, he heard it, so what's your top three favorite porn categories? 
<laughs> Boys locker room. Now I'm going to talk for myself now. Boys locker room. Um, male on male pink sock and <laughs> bear. <laughs> I fucked up. Guilt to the Roy. <laughs> Kim is so cute. I was looking at your stories today, Kim. Oh, look at that. I saw that one. You said dinner. It was. It looked like some macaroni and gravy you had there. It looked delicious. And she had pictures with a hubby. Nice, cute family pictures. Joe, did you ever see Lenny shoot snot at the camera? Yes, I had. It's fucking hysterical, bro. Well, it's that famous like picture with the fucking, he's got like a rope hanging. My favorite category is SSBPW and docking. <laughs> Anal blowjob and then he's parking lot. <laughs> docking is gay for gays. I mean, it's just so, it's so weird. <laughs> I guess it's like the equivalent of tripping. <laughs> Girls masturbating and girl, I love solo uh, girl masturbating ones because uh, I, I I try to pretend that we're jerking off together. I'm so lonely. I need, I need to fuck. <laughs> Who wants to fuck me, Mister Maniac? Can you fuck me? <laughs> can help a cucumber, big lady tranny bedroom bully creep boys? <laughs> can you shoot a snot at the no for the piss? No, I don't want to make all the girls tune out, because then it's going to be a fucking sausage fest here. <laughs> you have to be uncircumcised. Yes, because you have to pull the skin over it. I guess if one is uncircumcised. Explain for the folks. Okay, docking is this. Elvis Aaron Presley was the man who women were crazy for. Joe, are you fair? I love Elvis Presley. I always said he was the first Guido. Even though he wasn't Italian, <laughs> and he wasn't he wasn't from the Northeast, but he was like the first like cool cuisine kind of guy. And Fonzie is kind of like based on like a Elvis James Dean kind of thing. Would you fuck me? I'd fuck me. Oh, that that's the tuck, the Silence of the Lambs tuck. Because I just saw Crystal writing, "You would you fuck me?" And I almost about to say, "Show's over." I'm calling Crystal, <laughs> but then I realized she was just being funny. It's still hot. I'm gonna screenshot that and jerk off to it. All right, docking. Two guys. I guess you got to be hard, right? And you go dick head to head, you know, with your dicks. And what you're supposed to do is you stretch the foreskin. So you got to be un at least one's got to be uncircumcised. He was North Sentinelese Elvis. <laughs> That's why he knew how to do that dance. <laughs> it was like from walking on the fires. <laughs> Ooh, this shit's hot, motherfucker. <laughs> Hula, humla, humla. <laughs> All right, here's, here's your two dicks. <laughs> he was like legal steroids props. And you stretch the skin over the other dick. And then you jerk off, like, all, your foreskin over the other guy's dick. So I guess when you come, it goes in his piss slash cum hole. <laughs> Strudeling. I never heard that one. Opie and Anthony always called it docking. So I guess if one guy is uncircumcised, so definitely if there's a black and a Jew... The black guy is the answer. It's okay, I'm not ordering Andrew. <laughs> well, you're not going to get this bottle, bro. <laughs> this one's empty. I already used it. See? <laughs> I wonder what they smoke in Sentinel Island be so aggressive and angry. Maybe they have meth plans. <laughs> no, they're all on testosterone. <laughs> the fucking weather there and the water there, they, it's like their test levels are like fucking 1,500 natural. <laughs> And there's one juice monkey there who sells it in the, in the locker hut. <laughs> He's got a mud hut and grass hut. <laughs> Come and heal, ooga booga. I sell you, I sell you good sustenance. <laughs> juice monkey, North Central <laughs> Big J, what's up, motherfucker? <laughs> Oh, City of T-Boosters, <laughs> your dabbing dad. Is that the dab? Is that still considered the dab? Like, why do they call it the dab? I remember Kaepernick used to do it, but fuck Kaepernick. He's a fucking savage. <laughs> what is the, like, dabbing, I would like, you know, dab my dick in her fucking cunt. That's 
<laughs> I hope Crystal Dusty the show that would be oh does the show <laughs> Dusty show <laughs> Cougar the Claw Sentinel Hooga Booga Hooga the Booga the Cougar the Claw Sentinel I'm back I use your talk and explanation excuse to go take my chicken from the oven <laughs> oh it's pot Joe no because uh, uh What's his, the the dab? Remember, like fucking uh, 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 fucking what's his name? Cam Newton and and Kaepernick and shit were doing it. But it can't be that. Cannoli is when you put powdered sugar on your ball bag and blow your load over the top of the other dick after dying. <laughs> if I do the show, I'll give up my pro. Oh yeah, you're not gonna give up your fucking pro status for a fucking NPC show. Come to the show to get drunk. And if Rich does the show, then you can scream, he's got a nine and a half fucking inch cock in that fucking, that's why he had to wear board shorts and fucking bodybuilding. They didn't make trunks fucking big enough for his cock. He's even bigger than Coleman. <laughs> Dab is dumb. I, I, I don't know. Joe, being truthful with you on this, my uncle, who is a twin, just like Elvis, is, was in the second army division in the army in 58. So he was in the army with Elvis? I'm a little confused. He has to have trunks special made. Does he have the elephant trunk in the front of it? That would be great. He should just go with his fucking cock sticking out of the fucking trunk. And then look at any of the female judges and just go... <laughs> I can tell you after the show I plan on getting drunk. Good, I want to buy one. Ever fuck the stuffed shell? They don't call it stuff for nothing. <laughs> so he was in the army with Elvis. That's fucking great, bro. I mean, fucking Elvis is, you know, he's the king. I mean, come on. Imagine the gram and the Caleb. Caleb, yo, what's up? It's big C's fucking new column is fucking kicking ass. He should do the helicopter with it on stage. <laughs> Get some mess. Uh, I used to go to church. <laughs> I get fucking uh, struck by lightning now. They were in the same platoon. That is so cool, man. Fucking, I would actually do fucking army time if I could fucking be in the fucking same place as Elvis. <laughs> Just to say, hey, fucking Elvis, he was my fucking boy. Who would win a contest? Bodybuilding, rich piano skeleton or vegetable soup? <laughs> no disrespect to piano. Helicopter. <laughs> you know, all you guys have done that. I do it all the time to show my wife. It doesn't do anything for her. Should probably mix terps through CBD. And all. I don't know any of that shit, man. That's not my fucking thing, man. Just give me fucking... Some fucking girl's funky foot to smell. I don't need no fucking CBD oil. <laughs> my high is taking everything you got and shoving my face down your throat. <laughs> what do you think about that, Dale? <laughs> Big J all day. <laughs> Rich does it with no hands to show off. The helicopter? Yeah, I do that too. And I'm plus, trust me, I am not saying I have anything close to nine. <laughs> But I, I, I kind of just like, I swish and sway. I call it the king of swing is actually what I used to call it. I have done the helicopter. My girl loves it. Yeah, your girl's cool. My fucking girl's lame. Lame, lame, lame. And she's like, and then when I go through menopause, I'm just going to get even worse. And I'm like, okay, I, I, I got to do what I got to do. <laughs> <You know? laughs> the helicopter. I'm like, this doesn't, like, turn you on at all? I said, if you whipped out your cunt and started spinning it around, <laughs> I'd be on my fucking hands and knees eating it. I'm not going to lie. Not only does it make me laugh, but he gets laid. Wait, hold on. He gets laid every time. See? I get nothing! Joe, do you do the salt and the swing, too? <laughs> Rumor has a rich piano still has an arm pump in the ground. Oil's... Oh, gee. Let's talk about Sumatropin. I don't know much about it. It's a brand new... Uh, Sponsor for Greg's show. Joe, check me out on Instagram. I'll be posting, hopefully, live me singing as Elvis. I sound exactly like him. You look like fucking, uh, 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 what's his name? Uh, like a fucking uh, Jim Morrison when he had the beard, like the L.A. woman. 71 Morrison. Uh, you're right, Crystal. I'm very odd. I like looking at Rich's cock when it's soft. When it's hard, I'm like, meh. Because you want to make it hard. You want to see the reaction. See, if he just comes up to you with a hard cock, 
He could have been looking at pictures of little boys before. <laughs> Don't tell him I said that. <laughs> He'll kill me. <laughs> Secret to sing, you spin me right around, round, round. <laughs> yes, that's called meatspin.com. It used to be a site. He sounds like Elvis now. You would think it's the real people. Yes, Crystal is a huge Elvis fan. I did know that. She had told me that years ago. My ex was like Crystal. She enjoyed seeing the transformation. <laughs> he looks like Bobby Sands. I don't know. Who's Bobby Sands? My husband's name is Rich. Is his name match his wallet? Thank you, Joe. I can sing like Jim Morrison. Love the Doors. The Doors were fucking insane, bro. They were a great fucking band. I'm a grower, not a shower. It's Big Rich, the Greek God. <laughs> Ron, we're gonna see Ron Harris at the Olympia. Ron Harris and Steve Blackman. Steve Blackman. Ah. Uh. He's the Greek, he's built like a Greek god. I should be so lucky. Watch what you say, Joe. Rich will beat you with that big cock. I know, it would fucking hurt. <laughs> Is it true? Elvis said Nutellas are only good for shining my shoes. <laughs> he actually liked the, the Nutellas because he kind of based a lot of his music on the old blues style that they were playing down south. Every end transformation, is that a Freudian slip? What do you think about M Michael Crizzo? I don't know who that is. I'm sorry. Nothing like being cock whipped. You motherfucker. She's killing me here. Oh, how much for a session? <laughs> Crystal, that's awesome. Elvis is the man. Yes, he was definitely um, uh, a one of a kind. Uh, Ed Sullivan did not want to show him his hips down because he thought it was too dirty when he shook his hips. How fucking... You think of how times have changed. You got fucking he-she's walking around fucking streets now with their cocks hanging out. Fucking smoking pot and fucking, you know... the. the <laughs> <laughs> and fucking immigrants all over the place, but you can't show Elvis shaking his hips. Oh, uh, Crystal has an even bigger dildo to use. There was no such thing as the biggest cock in the world, because somebody will create a dildo bigger. <laughs> Johnny Cash, the man in black. In your life, you pass by 37 murderers in public? Wow. He's South Africa Arnold, classic whiner. Headache bow, what's up? Headache, headache ball, what's up? Headache ball, I got a fucking ball ache. Eddie Sell, Eddie Sell learns. I guess he had no choice. <laughs> he wanted ratings. Ariana transformation can only be verified with a wide angle lens. I mean, if you put a magnifying glass for that. My seven hundred pounds life. What's up, pal? Welcome to the show, there, skinny. Joe would love to get beat with Crystal's dildo. Yes, unwashed. I want it fucking just. Fucking still sticky. <laughs> go live with Hamburg. I'll go live with you, motherfucker. 700 pounds ripped. Where is Hamburg? I'll go live. Hamburg was on, what was that? Last week we had Hamburg. He was down in Miami having a couple of cocktails. Outdoor, it looks so good. All oh, those beers go down so nice when you're sitting in the fucking outdoors like that. Joe, savor the flavor. Oh, man. Crystal's flavor must be like, it, she must taste like delicious macaroni. <laughs> Fresh out of the ass, definitely. Yeah, I would definitely want some ass juice on that. I noticed the last pic you posted of me with the pink dildo. Curry said he had nothing to say. <laughs> oh, I guess he liked it. I I have jerked off to that video with the red bra and the dildo when you're doing the, the why it's bent that way. I've I've come to that fucking uh, wildfire uh, spreading like wildfire episode. There is just hard working pays off. Yes, I work hard every day doing this show. <laughs> so, hey, what do you do for a living? Oh, I talk about jerking off to Crystal while she's watching me on Instagram. <laughs> no, I mean, like, what do you do for a job? That's, yeah, that's what I do. <laughs> I need to start making more videos. Yes, please. Please. And, and definitely, like, uh, shh. Shit in one of them. Like, do one from a, a girl shitting's angle. Like, <laughs> oh man, there's this fucking broad I follow, Gwyneth Lee, I think. 
She's an older MILF. She's got nice fucking feet, too. And she had a story where she's videoing in a lady's room in the mirror, and her friend is sitting... I guess, no, it must have been in her house, because there was no stall, so duh. And her friend's sitting there pissing with the fucking pants and panties down by the knees. I got real turned on. Uh, real turned on. Uh, Jim Croce. Yes, Jim Croce was great. Uh, another young guy, yeah. A lot of people died young uh, that were great stars. Joe, when you finished it, put it... Did it put out the wildfire? <laughs> she is so hot, she can never be fucking deflamed. What do you think about Dennis Wolf in 2007, Mr. Olympia? Wasn't that the year that everybody says Victor Martinez should have beat Jay Cutler? If I remember correctly. Source for Yibe. What's up, pal? How the fuck are you? Welcome to the program. Um, I don't really remember Dennis Wolf in that one. That's going back a ways. But I, I do know, I think Victor looked really good in that one. And then 08, um, Dexter, I was at the 08, was my first Olympian in person. And then that was uh, 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 with uh, Dexter. LOL, this is Crystal Wildfire Anthony with another episode of Spreading Like Wildfire. Doing my show while shitting on the toilet. Kaplunk. <laughs> and you hear the fucking splash. Ooh, it's cold. <laughs> what video is Crystal <laughs> making? Uh, Mamby, she has a, a series on Muscle Sport TV called Spreading Like Wildfire. A little play on words, obviously, with the title. And uh, in one of them, she was wearing a beautiful red lacy bra and jerking a uh, pink rubber dildo. Big bed wolf. Yeah, wolf, I think wolf's kind of... I think he's kind of... He, he, I don't think we're going to see him really on stage much at all anymore. I, he was great. Great bodybuilder. And, uh, and that, and, but, you know, he's injuries and shit. Joe, what's the closest you ever got to the police brutality? What do you mean closest? <laughs> when he regrets as a cop, you felt like maybe I went too hard on this poor schmuck. <laughs> never. <laughs> Fuck them all. <laughs> I never fucked with a good guy. Trust me, they were all bad guys. <laughs> it's like fucking Omar. I never put my fucking gun on nobody that wasn't in the game. <laughs> Every one of these motherfuckers deserved everything they got. Not saying they got anything, but they deserved it. In case. <laughs> I like your lives. Go ahead. Thanks for answering my question. You rock. Oh, okay. Bro, do, dude, I do this shit three times a week. I'll be back tomorrow at 3, 3, 3 o'clock for uh, Titan Medical Center presents Ask Me Anything. Kill all PMS. PMS, like, like when the girl's going to have a period. <laughs> Yeah, Dennis Wolf was a really good. He won that 09, not 09. Was that the 10 or the 11 Arnold? 08 and 09. Uh, 09 and 10 were, uh, was a uh, Kai. They deserve what they might have. There you go, Crystal. See, I need Crystal to fucking put the correct words out there. She articulated it exactly. Omar was the best. Oh, so you're a boy? Ariana, you and I have a lot in common. Are you sure you're not me? <laughs> hey, you got any honey nut? <laughs> Omar, that, Michael K. Williams was great as Chalky also in Boardwalk. But I love... Yo, yo, Omar! <laughs> Let's go. Throw it down. Poof, you see the crack coming down in that big garbage bag. <laughs> Newport. Soft pack. <laughs> and that's when the kid comes in and shoots him. <laughs> And the Chinese lady, ah. The Corner is another unbelievable HBO fucking miniseries. I'm not very articulate. I've had a few shots getting ready to nap before work. Oh, you, oh, a shot? What, like a dildo? <laughs> oh, pork monkey. <laughs> okay, I gotcha. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I will be back for your lives. Good night. Thanks, my friend. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll uh, see you tomorrow, I hope. My father in law is a Vietnam vet. God bless him, bro. When he came back, he was a bouncer at a rough bar. I used to beat serious ass. Hold on, hold on. Uh, in the parking lot, and then kick guys under a truck. Man, Vietnam vets, fucking full fucking respect, man. They got fucked double. The corner is great, only for... It was six, actually. Six, six one-hour episodes. The last one was, like, a little longer, like a... 70 minutes long. Yesterday I was in a video chat with a girl. I forgot 
they weren't in the piss, so I told her I wanted to function as a tampon. They burst out laughing on this show. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I need to buy stock in vodka. Ooh. Vanilla. I know which drink she has. I bought her drinks before. Crystal, please check out on my live show, Singing Like Elvis. Ever see The Wire, the musical on YouTube? No, is it? I'm sure it's a goof. I think D'Angelo is in the corner right there. <laughs> Yo, D! <laughs> Where's Wallace, man? Can you believe Wallace is fucking Creed? He was such a goofball when he was on the wire. And he turned into like a, this fucking sexy stud <laughs> with a six-pack. Did you already do the live, Rivers? Not yet, Chris. Hamburg! What's up, motherfucker? How were those beers that day? They look really good. You know why I like drinking in the outdoors in the fucking hot weather? You gotta drink fast or else the beer gets flat quick. So you fucking bang, 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 bang. Next thing you know, you're like fucking six or seven in. You're like, whoa, I feel great. I barely had fucking breakfast. Go live with Brother Hamburg. Yo, man, Michael B. Jordan. Yeah, that's, he, he shouldn't call himself Michael B. Jordan. He should just call himself MB or something. Because <laughs> it sounds like... <laughs> Poor Wallace was the saddest death in the wire. Yeah, because his own boys did it to him. Poot! And fucking, uh, and Bodie. <laughs> Home in Sweden now, still hung over. Oh, shit, man. I give you credit, man. You've been down there a few times, and you enjoy every fucking second, which is the way to do it, man. Just go and fucking fuck a doodle-doo, you know? You just go and have a good fucking time.